end up with a touch off the boot of Connor Chapman. Oh, it's Josh Mitchell. Front start to Thomas Broich. Oh, and Bartlett's come flying in. He can find himself in a bit of trouble here as well. Mitchell's gone to ground, straight back to his feet. I think Mitchell's going to be in trouble. He just picked up a yellow card for the penalty. This could well be a second yellow. I don't think Eric Pavlo's going to escape sanction either. The referee's heading immediately into his pocket. He's got both cards out. It is silly from Josh Mitchell, reacting as he did to whatever. It is the second yellow. Mitchell's off before half-time. And it's a red card for Thomas Broich as well. Well, what's it going to be for Eric Pardaloo? The red card's gone back into the pocket. Pardaloo might consider himself a little bit lucky. Well, the initial contact was between Broich and Mitchell. Mitchell jumped back to his feet and just pushed Thomas Broich over. And there, I'm not really sure, unless it's that initial contact that the referee... Well has decided was worth penalising with a red card. Mitchell's gone. Reutsch to follow. Oh, what an amazing sequence of events. There's more cards coming. Perhaps. It's a yellow card for Connor Chapman. Third A-League game for Brenton Haywood. And things have exploded what, somewhat. What did you say his nickname was? Red Card Hayward. He's right on message. Well, Josh Mitchell was silly. And that was an obvious one. He just received a yellow card. And reacting as he did to whatever Thomas Broich did was going to be a second yellow. Now, Broich stands his ground. That's not a red card for Thomas Broich. I'm sorry. What we don't see on that replay. Here it is, Broich. Oh, simple in that. Newcastle are away. It's a golden opportunity for a counter-attack blown by Josh Mitchell by reacting. But he's got something out of it. Somehow Thomas Broich has been sent off for that. Partlew, I thought, was going to be in trouble. Apparently not. Well, it was Partlew that certainly looked in more danger on first viewing than Thomas Broich. It's not the way the referee saw it.